All right. So now that you have edited your photos, to turn it in, I want to see your contact sheet. So you are going to basically make a sheet showing thumbnails of all your images. As you know, this term comes from darkroom photography, where you put your negatives on a piece of photo paper and make a contact print. But we are going to make a digital version of that. So what you're going to do is, if you're in your collection, you can just do Control A. Oops, Control A to select all your images. Um, this should include your edits as well as any rejects that you did not turn in. Then up at the top, we're going to go to the print module. We are then going to go to the template browser and you're going to show the Lightroom templates and you can go and you'll see that there's four options for contact sheets. Um, you can click through and you basically want to make the largest thumbnails um, where all your fit pictures will fit in. Later on, um, you'll have a lot more pictures and you might have multiple pages. Um, but for this project, you probably only need one sheet. You can also go over to layout and you'll see rows and columns so you can adjust that if needed. So you could maybe subtract a row and then that might make it a little bit bigger where you could subtract a column and it'll make it a little bit bigger. There's all sorts of options here, um, but you can ignore most of them. Then what you're gonna do is scroll all the way down to print job. You're gonna print to JPEG file. That is going to save this as a file. And then it should say down here, print to file. You're going to click on that and you're going to select a place to save it to. I'm going to go to my Google Drive, my drive. I can go to my web exports folder that we've created and we export to. Um, and then I can call it Nolling contact sheet that way i oops nolan nolan contact sheet then you're going to go ahead and hit you can also save it to your nolan folder if you have that already and hit save now it should be saved in your google drive and you should have your contact sheet so a digital file of what we see on the screen